So you've got a fish in the net, what next? Well, I'm Bonesy and I'm here to show you how to weigh a fish correctly. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you how to get your stuff all prepared and ready before you lift the fish out the water. First thing you're gonna need is your unhooking mat. So I've got my unhooking mat ready. I've got a water container next to it that I'm gonna fill up with water and just douse the mat to make sure it's nice and wet to protect the fish. I'm then gonna refill my water container, place it next to the mat so it's there for me to be able to wet the fish. The next thing, I'm gonna get my scales out, pop them next to the mat, and I'm gonna get my retainer. Now what's really important is you wet your retainer properly. No good just dipping the bottom of it in, you need to submerge the whole thing so it's really covered in water to protect the fish. But this is also important to make sure that the weight of the fish is very accurate. Once I've wetted my retainer, I'm going to get it over to the mat, I'm going to hook on my scales and I'm going to zero my scales. This is something a lot of people forget to do, but is by far the most important part to get a correct weight of that fish. So what I'm going to do, hook on my retainer, twist the adjuster knob or if you've got digital scales, just press the tar button and I'm going to set it so it is bang on zero. Once it gets to this, I know that the scales have negated the weight of the retainer. Then I'm gonna place my retainer nice and neatly over the unhooking mat, and the next thing is to get the fish out of the water. So let's get the fish out of the water. Now to do this safely, the easiest way to do it is to break down your landing net and roll it down. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna remove one of the arms from the landing net, I'm gonna put them together and ensure the fish is in line with those arms. Once it is, I'm gonna roll them down all the way down, all the way down till you get close to the fish. This means I've got the fish nice and secure in the net and there's no way of it getting out. Always check that the fish's fins are flat to the body before lifting it out of the water. Once I've done this, I'm gonna very gently take a good grip of it and I'm gonna pick up the fish out of the water and my rod and walk it over to my unlucky mat. So I've got my fish safely onto the mat. All I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna unravel the net. I'm gonna very gently remove the hook then once I've done that, I'm gonna just lift the fish's head slightly. I'm gonna take hold of the net and I'm just gonna very gently draw it underneath the fish and get it out the way. So with the net out of the way, I'm gonna zip my retainer up completely to ensure there's no way this fish can get out of the retainer. So once you've got to this point, I'm next gonna just check again the pectoral fins to make sure they're nice and flat against the sling take hold of the two loops to weigh the fish, hook on the scales, then I'm gonna pick it up and get an accurate weight of this fish. So there we go. Now the reading I always take with a set of Rubens is the lowest part that the needle falls to. So it fell to 1815. So this fish is 18 pound, 15 ounces. A little drop of water, and I'll just show you a absolutely beautiful, 18 pound 15 mirror cup. <laughs> I hope that this video has helped you guys understand how to weigh a fish nice and accurately. <laughs>